Hey, we're at the Washington Square Dorothy Lane Market location. Tom Arvin joins us, the spicy Greek. Now, Tom, let's get right to it. We got lots to talk about, little time. Now, a lot of folks are bringing their grills out for the first time this season, so what do you need to do? Uh, the best thing to do, most important thing, make sure your grates are clean. Take a little vegetable oil on a paper towel, oil them up really well. Food won't stick. Get some nice grill marks. Mm -hmm. You can use the pan spray. Just make sure you do that before you light the grill. Okay, now steaks. Some people like medium, some people like rare. How am I going to know it's going to turn out right? Easiest way, just Put your finger in, touch it while it's cooking. The softer it is, the less done it is, the firmer it is, the more well done it is. Um, most important thing, make sure you take your steaks or chops or roast, whatever you're cooking. Let them rest for five or ten minutes before you slice them so you don't lose all your juices. Okay, look at a chicken and you got the shish kebab going on there. And, and folks, it looks intimidating, but this is easy, isn't it? And we got to talk about your spices. You were on our show uh, months back, but you, you came up with the spices. They're great, folks. We're going to tell you how to get these spices, but do I spice before, during? When do I do it? Actually, a little bit of both. Most of the times before, uh, we develop these spices for people that really don't know a lot about seasoning. Each blend contains why, why'd ingredients. you look at me when you said well, that? It was, it was, at, okay. You got the implication. <laughs> Each blend contains 10 ingredients. They're all natural, uh, MSG and gluten free. Nice. Uh, very, very easy to use. Uh, poultry, take some chicken, throw it in a Ziploc bag, some vegetable oil, some lemon juice, and the poultry spice. Mix it up, let it sit for a couple hours or overnight. Shish kebab, we got some beautiful Dorothy Lee Market pork and vegetables. Got a beautiful ribeye steak, some fresh uh, zucchini and squash and portobello mushrooms grilled. Just brush them with a little olive oil, sprinkle some vegetable seasoning on. This food is just so great on the grill. We can get away from the dogs and the burgers a little bit. It's just so easy to do, and, you know, people are a little intimidated doing some of these but then, these items, but it really is very, very easy to do. Tom, thank you very much. WDTN.com, click Booker's Beat for more information, or you can get the spices at any Dorothy Lane market. They're at each Dorothy Lane location. Happy Fourth of July to you, young man, and we appreciate it. All right. Jim Booker, two news on your side.